Hey friends, did you watch that? How did it make you feel? I got scared. I thought the bus might hit this little child. And he could get very badly hurt. Don't you agree? Jojo felt the same way when he landed on planet Earth. No, no, that's not Jojo. He is Jojo. He is from another planet. His spaceship accidentally left him on our planet. Vehicle from here and another from there. Oh my god, looks like I have gotten myself into trouble. Friends, Jojo is in need of your help. Can you tell him which are the safety rules he should know to save himself from road accidents? Yes, Jojo should know about road safety rules. That's the only way he can avoid getting into any kind of trouble. Can you help Jojo learn the road safety rules? Now, you will be shown different scenes and situations related to road safety and you will have to judge whether Jojo is following road safety rules or not. Yes, my friends, Jojo is crossing the road the right way. Wherever a zebra crossing is available, pedestrians should use it to cross the road. It is also important for you to know that one should cross the road using the zebra crossing only when there is red light for vehicles. In this scene, you can see that Jojo is crossing the road by moving past the stationary vehicles. Now, what do you think? Is this the right way to cross the road? No children! Jojo's way of crossing the road is not right. Well, now you must be thinking why should we not cross the road by walking past stationary vehicles? It is highly possible that the driver may start the car suddenly or fails to see Jojo walking past the car. Oh, oh, what is Jojo doing here? Hmm, I guess I already told you that Jojo is doing something wrong again. Yes, you thought it right. Jojo didn't even pay attention to the fact that on a road where there is no pavement, he should walk facing the traffic. Otherwise, a car can come and hit him from behind. Wow, what a hit by Jojo. But wait, is it right to play on the road? What do you think? Jojo probably doesn't understand that a road isn't a playground. Roads are for vehicles only. If Jojo wants to play, then he should go to a place like a park or a vacant plot or a playground. Move! Please, move aside! Is Jojo cycling on the right side of the road? Yes, Jojo is doing the right thing in this scene. One must ride their bicycle only on the left side of the road. Woohoo! It is so much fun! Today, I will go on a bus ride. Oh no! The bus is moving away. I better run or I'll miss it. What do you think about Jojo's way of boarding the bus? Um, it looks like Jojo was in a hurry to board the bus. But that's not the right way. Can you tell why? It's because boarding the bus this way could harm Jojo and he could have hurt himself badly. Children, I want you to carefully watch this scene again. Jojo made one more mistake. While traveling on a bus, one must not stand on the footboard of the bus because a slight jerk can lead to a fall and you can be seriously injured. Now look at the scene and think for yourself. Is Jojo a safe fellow traveler? 
yes. You know why? Because Jojo knows that one should always wear a helmet while riding on a two-wheeler. Helmets are meant not only for adults but also for children. Jojo is aware that he must always sit behind the biker and never in front to avoid an accident. All small children should do the same. Now tell us, do you also ride on the tank of a motorbike while going to school? Look at Jojo trying to learn about the road signs. People moving on the road whether they are pedestrians or those who drive any sort of vehicle should know about these signs. What about you? Have you ever noticed these road signs? If not, then pay attention next time when you travel on the road and don't forget to discuss what you see with your classmates and your teacher.